Well, looking ahead next weekend, a beloved local food festival returns paired with a 100 year celebration. Joining us in studio with a preview of the annual Greek food festival, we have Anthony Regpala and Tanya Al Sheik. Thank you for stopping by. Thank you for having us. I love this. I go every year. My family is from Greece. My great great grandfather, I'm very far removed. But I love that we have such a Greek culture here in town. Tell us about the church and the festival. So it's the 100th year of this church being in Bakersfield and the 50th year of the Greek food festival. Um, it's a really great opportunity for people to learn about the Greek culture, learn about the church, and also try all the food that we have to offer. And the great thing about our festival is we basically make everything from scratch. Oh, it's so good. It's all local food. Again, a celebration of culture. You brought some treats to I show did. off some of the tastes we're going to have. What is all this? Um, so you have the braided cookies here. These are kularakia. The middle cookie here is a spice cookie dipped in honey and topped with walnuts. It's called yeah. melomakaina. Okay. And then the powdered sugar cookie is a butter cookie with powdered sugar on top, and it's called Ecorumpiedas. I just love it. And then, of course, all the savories, the domatas, the gyros, everything is there for you to just eat until you burst. But then you dance off the calories. Well, and that's this <laughs> guy. Yeah, yeah we, we will be dancing on Friday at 8, uh, Saturday at 4 p.m. and 8 p.m., and Sunday at 2. Yeah, and uh, we do invite the audience to join us after we dance, so that's a lot of fun. Um, go ahead and bring the friends and family over there. We also have a kids zone and uh, with, um, with bounce houses. All that, and yeah, it's a lot of fun, yeah. <laughs> a lot of fun, and it's so hot this weekend, but this event is next weekend. The forecast looking cooler, which is great, because this is all outdoors, but on Sunday, you're welcoming people into the church. Absolutely, we have a service that starts at 9 p.m., or I'm sorry, 9 a.m., <laughs> that would be crazy. Um, and we just ask that people dress respectfully for yes. church, but otherwise, it's like a great opportunity just to see <clears throat> what the service is like and what we do. It's a very old school, traditional service, but it will be in partially in Greek and partially in English. I just love it. It's beautiful. It's such a celebration of culture, like you mentioned, of the religion, of the church itself. And then you just stuff your face and dance, which I love. It's, it's a so great, great time. The cool thing is the band, so the food will stop being served at 10 p.m. The band will keep playing till 11. Okay. And then we'll have the dancing available. The dance group will still be out there mm -hmm. having people participate with them. Perfect. And so all of this is available on your website. It's Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. The hours shift a little bit, but opa, it's going to be a good time. Very excited to have everybody. Thank you for stopping by and showing off the treats. We're excited to come. Glad to do it.